Kia everyone, my name is Berta and welcome back to our channel. In today's video I am doing a bit of a haul. Uh, we went shopping recently in Hamilton and we went to the chemist warehouse I think it's called. And it's like a chemist warehouse so everything's already cheaper than what you'd pay like in the supermarket or at a drugstore or at a farmers or Kmart. Um, it was already cheaper and then they had 40% off so that's why I went a little bit crazy and I got a whole bunch of things and I thought that would be a cool idea if I sat down, did a bit of a haul, you know, throwing it back to the good old haul days. <laughs> Sounded like I said haul days. If this is something that you want to watch, obviously that's why you've clicked on it. So, just keep on watching. But before you do that, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell down below so you can keep updated with all of our new content. Let's get straight into it. This is the damage that we done. It's like almost as long as my arm. We're just going to start off with the boring things. I got some head and shoulder shampoo and conditioner. Well, it says down here, why pay $12.49 when you can pay $7.99? So, yeah, these were $8. I don't know, is that even cheap? I don't know, but we brought them anyway. And... Cool. Another kind of boring thing. I got the Batiste Dry Shampoo Plus with a hint of colour. Beautiful brunette. This says, why pay $13.99 when you can pay $8.99? Awesome. Alright, next up, another thing that's kind of boring but I'm kind of excited about is the Beauty Wipes from Milk. I really like the look of these. They're extra large exfoliating and cleansing wipes. I like the look that they're like nice and big. And these were, why pay $11.14 when you could pay $6.99? So, you know, only $7, really digging that. Next up, I got the Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in the shade 25 Medium. This is, like it says, a loose powder from Maybelline. Um, I've seen a lot of really good things about this and so I thought I'd pick it up, but it says, why pay $19.99 when you can pay $10.19? I'm really excited to try that out. Alrighty, next up I got these two Face Studio Primes from Maybelline. I got the Hydrating Primer and the Anti-Redness Primer. I mainly got these for the kit, just because, like, you know, quite often we'll have people with dry skin or, like, red skin and, oh, not red, but, you know like discolored skin and so I thought I'd try these out oh my gosh how much were they oh they were like eight dollars so and why pay eighteen dollars ninety nine when you can pay eight dollars so I'm really excited about using those and those are going straight in the kit another base primer thing that I got was the L'Oreal Paris base magic I think that's how you say it because I'm like French or whatever I think this was pretty expensive. Yeah, it was like $18, but it's like says, why pay $37 when you can pay $18? So I'm excited to try this out. I've heard that it's kind of like the, is it the Bobby Brown base thing? Oh, that feels really good. So I'm really excited about that. And that is not for the kit, that is for moi. Next up I got one of my favourite powders which is from Rimmel and it's their Stay Matte Powders. I really enjoy these, they're both in our kit and just in my kit. Normally these are just really good face powders. I got one in the shade 001 Transparent and a darker shade in 004 Sandstorm. We've already got one of these in our makeup kit so this one's for me and this one's for the makeup kit. And these were... Why pay $14.99 when you can pay $8.74? Also picked up the Maybelline Lasting Drama Automatic Gel Pencil. Um, I really like these black eyeliners. I just feel like they're a really good drugstore alternative. Why pay $19.99 when you can pay $8? Now I think that I might just put this one in the kit because I don't really use black eyeliner. I also picked up the pressed powder from Fit Me in the shade 235. Again, we need more face powders for the kit and I know that this is a really good one. I use it quite often and I've gone through a few of them so yeah. Why pay $19.99 when you can pay $8.99? So that's cool and that's going straight in the kit. thing that I didn't pick up for the kit 
was the L'Oreal Paris Infallible More Than Concealer in the shade Latte. Um, I've been seeing heaps of really good things about this and I thought that I would pick it up. It looks a little bit like like similar like chubby packaging to the Tarte one and I got this one in a slightly lighter shade so yeah excited for that. Why pay $29.99? When you can pay $14.99. I picked up the good old Instant Age Rewind from Maybelline. This is like a ride or die. Concealer, really like it. Picked up one for me. Why pay $22.99 when you can pay $10.67? We're nearing the end in Etifano. I picked up the Burberry Brit Rhythm Perfume. I have a whole bunch of like big perfumes and I need one that I can just like take chuck in my purse. This was why pay $18.99 when you can pay $12.99. I don't even know why I'm going to show you this because you just can't smell it. But yeah, it's just this little roll on moment. It's kind of just like a florally sweet moment. The last few things that I got were from Maybelline and they're a bunch of their new Nouveau lipsticks. Maybelline's Matte Daring Nudes. And I'm gonna swatch all of these on here for you. Am I? Because it's wrapped in sellotape. I'm not, guys, so sorry. <sighs> but I thought I would get these for our kit. Did I buy any of this stuff for me? No, not really. I got them all in these nude shades, which are perfect for wedding season. So that was everything that I got in our shopping spree that we had at the Chemist Warehouse. I hope you guys enjoyed that haul, and if you did, then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and hit that notification bell down below so you can keep updated with all of our new content. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you in our next video. Kaki